Megan from Sew and Tell Australia. In this video, I'm going to be doing a pattern review of the Tada Jaunty Knit Dress. Woo! This is a really cute pattern. It's from Tada Patterns. Uh, it comes in a size 1 to 12 and it's got a number of options. So you can have long sleeve, which I've done here. There's also a short sleeve version. There is two skirts versions. You can have the circle skirt or a gathered skirt. You can also have two layers. So there is a short layer and then you can have a long layer. So you can actually have them both on the same skirt so that you get this kind of double skirt look, which is really, really cool. So on this version, I actually did a chul overlay. So as you can see, it's got this cute chul overlay. I did the gathered skirt version. So what I did was I made the knit gathered skirt and I put a chul gathered skirt over the top so that you get this really cute kind of just party dress really. I've made this for one of my daughter's friends. She's having a birthday party this weekend. So I thought it would be a really good opportunity to make her a cute little dress, which my daughter actually wants to claim. Uh, it's aimed at an advanced beginner, but I really think a beginner could do this if they took their time. So as with all Tada patterns, it is very well written out and instructed. So definitely an easy one to follow. Um, it comes with projector format as well. So that's always a plus, but there is the A4 and A0 versions as well. It is a layered file, so you can turn the layers on and off, which is another good function when working with patterns so that you can turn the layers off for the versions you don't need, trace it out or just print and cut it out. Um, the other thing I really like about this is it's just really versatile. Like I've mentioned, you can have a number of different options with it. I find the instructions very easy to, to follow, so that's a good one. So this is my review on the Jaunty Knit Dress. I think it's a good one to have in your pattern stash. Um, yeah. That is it. Hopefully you found this helpful. If you want to keep seeing my pattern reviews, education, tips and tricks, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Otherwise, you can join me on my socials. I'm on Instagram at SewAndTellAU or on Facebook, SewAndTellAustralia. I also have my pattern reviews that I write on my blog, SewAndTell.com.au. Thanks everyone and have a really nice day. Thanks.